I'm Dr. Fizzbot, and I'm ecstatic to see you. Today, we're going to look at one of God's most colorful creations, rainbows. And you won't have to wait for a storm to pass to see this one. We'll be using crayons and heat to recreate a rainbow with this magnificent and wondrous and maybe messy experiment. Today at Fizzbop Labs, I am assisted by Elsie! Let's get started. First, a warning. This experiment requires high heat, so safety first. And like many of our experiments, it can be messy. So make sure that you protect the area you are working in. And now the Fizzlebop supply list. We'll need crayons, red, orange, yellow, green, blue, violet, and indigo if you have it. We'll also need tape, a piece of white poster board, an easel, or a few books will do, a pair of safety goggles, and a hair dryer. Excellent. Pause the video and go gather those supplies. We'll wait right here. We'll begin by peeling the paper off of each crayon. Next, we'll line up the crayons in the color order of a real rainbow. Red, orange, yellow, green, blue, and violet. Fizz-tastic. Now, we need to tape the crayons to the top center of the poster board. Fantastic. Next, let's attach a poster board to the easel. Here's a very useful fizz tip. Let's place some paper towels under the bottom of the cardstock for an easier cleanup. That's a fantastic idea! Okay, now we need to put on our safety goggles. Now, we're going to aim the hairdryer at the bottom tips of the crayons and turn the hairdryer on. Let's observe as the solid wax of the crayons melts and liquefies, then begins to stream down the cardstock. Do not Touch the melted crayons until they have had time to cool. I hope when you're done, you'll snap a picture and post it online so we can see the results of your marvelous experiment. Tag us at Fizzlebop Labs and use hashtag Fizzlebop. Dr. Fizzlebop, what's happening? Well, crayons are made of wax, and wax happens to be a marvelous substance. It can go from solid to liquid and back to solid, all with a change in temperature. When we applied the heat from the hairdryer to the crayons, 
they liquefied and the hot wax dripped down the cardstock. And when we stopped using the hairdryer, the wax began to cool and reform into a solid. This is called a reversible physical change. And we saw it in true wondrous color. Isn't that fantastic? It's time to collect our data. You can record it under this experiment in Faith and Science with Dr. Fizzbop on page 26 or in your Fizzbop Labs notebook. Observe how the wax dripped down the cardstock. What could you have done to change the flow of the melted wax? Hmm, great question. Can you think of other substances that can undergo reversible change? I'll give you a hint. Hmm, wait, wait, let me guess, let me guess. Hmm. I don't know. What do you think it is? One can go on toast. Another... Ooh, ooh. Mm -hmm. Okay, what's the next what's the next one? Another everything. Oh, I'll think about this. This is a real challenge. Hey, tag us at Fizzbop Labs if you've got the answer. That's it! Enjoy your melted cran rainbow. I hope you'll share it with me by tagging at Fizzbop Labs and using hashtag Fizzbop. Thanks for joining us here at Fizzbop Labs. I'm Dr. Fizzbop, and I hope you had as fantastic time as we have. Join us here each week for a new experiment.